Saturday, November 18th. We hope your weekend is off to a good start. I'm Matt Hamill, joined alongside meteorologist Rhythm Reed. Here's a look in Halifax, the fall vibes in the air. But as we're about to find out, Halifax and much of Atlantic Canada seeing some uh, pretty impactful weather for today. And that's being brought in part by this weather bomb. It's a dramatic name for a weather phenomena and our meteorologist Rhythm Reed is here to break it all down. Rhythm, first up, before we talk about today's weather, what is the whole definition of a weather bomb? Well, I know it sounds so ominous, a weather bomb, but Basically, it is a low pressure system that intensifies quite rapidly. So it has to drop by 24 millibars within 24 hours. And that's what we're going to be tracking as it makes its way into Atlantic Canada for today. Hey, Rhythm, now what is kind of the special setup for today? Because it's not just that low that's intensifying. There's also a cold front already in the mix. So a couple different factors here. Yeah, so the cold front is what's going to be starting off this yeah. rapid intensification. We have this cold air that moves in that southeasterly direction. And then it's collided with the warm ocean temperatures, the warmer air. And what we see with when both of those collide is that rising air. And that what helps to intensify the these lows much faster and that's exactly what we're going to continue to see as it moves up towards us here in Atlantic Canada. So a couple of different impacts here. I think that perhaps the most profound is going to be the strong winds rhythm. We had that potential for power outages, but we're seeing rain as well as snow in the mix as well. So let's kind of walk through what we're seeing in Atlantic Canada really intensifying this evening. Well, Matt, I think you set it up quite well. We have that cold front coming in that's going to bring the initial band of showers, but as this this low moves up towards us here in Atlantic Canada this evening, bringing with it those strong winds. We're going to start to see that rain coming down through the Maritimes for today. Up towards areas of New, New Brunswick, we can see in those higher elevations definitely getting some snow. And by the time we hit tomorrow morning, well, the eyes are going to be set on areas of Newfoundland, bringing widespread showers. And then for Labrador, well, they're going to be getting a lot of snow through the area and no shortage of weather alerts that have already been issued rhythm and now let's kind of uh, get a bit of a closer look as well at just how strong the winds and just how much rain and snow we're dealing with yeah we're going to take a look at the weather alerts first so we have those rainfall warnings for nova scotia and those wind warnings up towards newfoundland we're going to talk more about those wind warnings but also snowfall warnings and winter storm warnings so let's start out with those wind gusts around areas of halifax we can see those winds getting all the way up to around 70 kilometers an hour through this evening but up towards Cape Breton and then up towards areas of Bergio well those winds are going to be the most impactful anywhere between 90 up to 100 kilometers an hour and by the time that it this system hits Newfoundland tomorrow morning that's where we can see those widespread areas of those power outages as those winds get up close to 100 kilometers an hour and even passing that yeah, so I mean, the one point I'm noticing there is it won't take long on our Sunday before the system kind of uh, passes out of the region, but certainly some impactful weather beginning on our Saturday evening by the looks of it. Absolutely. And let's take a look real quick at how much rain we're going to get. And it's pretty interesting where that low is going to be directed. That's where all those rainfall is going to be the heaviest. So 50 to 80 millimeters for the most part. But I'm sure a lot of people are wondering what about the snow, right, Matt? Are oh, you yes. excited about the snow? Maybe not, but uh, it is going to be confined mostly to Labrador. You see parts of eastern Quebec, New Brunswick may be in line for some snow. So a messy system for our weekend. 